Hello everybody, Anderson Gaming here and today we are live with Assassin's Creed Origins again. If you're watching me for the first time, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. I will set up the stream and then we shall begin. So we'll be continuing like uh, as usual, uh, continuing off from the last stream, we'll be exploring and unlocking the uh, undiscovered areas of the map before we get to the end of the game. I think Friday I might play something new, Must, I'm thinking of playing Arkham City, let's see. Arkham City in our difficulty. What the hell is this? Oh. Nice. 
Just opening up the map. Hello Siddharth, welcome. How are you bro? Can you hear me? Oh no. Court case, so need to visit unnecessary hassle. Asking them if they can wait for a few months. Shit man. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, I will pray for you, brother. I wish that you get out of this uh, situation as quickly as possible, and uh, hopefully, you have enough people to help you. Yeah, but very sorry to hear that, brother. You have my my regards, my best regards. Definitely, definitely. When if people come in here, I will not tell you the I will not tell everybody the details of what's going on with you, but uh, I will tell them that you are going through some difficulties, and I'll uh, tell them to pray for you or help you. Yeah, sorry to hear that, bro. Happens to everybody. Happened to me also. Happened to my my parents. Now everything is fine. Just like how things worked out for my family, same will happen to you also. Don't worry, bro. That wind will raise the suns. Always think positive thoughts. Everything will be fine. Yeah, only need time. Time will heal everything, fix everything. You'll be fine, bro. Don't worry. Thanks for coming here, though. Even though you... I know it's not easy for you, alright? Every day is like a challenge for you. I get that. You don't have to be at my streams. I can understand. But I do appreciate you popping in whenever you can. I appreciate it, brother. Thank you so much. But seriously, you do not have to be here. Because, you know, you could be spending this time for other things. I'm trying to find solutions to fix your problems. But you are still here and I respect that. So, thank you. You are not... Not like many of my fake subscribers that come here trying to put on a show that they are indeed supporting me and they will leave in just 10 seconds. Even if you leave also, I wouldn't take it the wrong way. Because I know you're somebody that's a real friend, you know. You're not, you're not a fake person. So, you know, if you have to leave the stream, if you have things to do, you can carry on. I, I won't take it the wrong way. Trust me, bro. Curse of Wadget! Snakes! 
Thanks for stopping by though, bro. Appreciate it. Yeah, people will do that. But at least you stay here for a while, you know. They they will come here within like two minutes, three minutes, like that sushi kid. He will come here. He won't even stay for like five minutes. He will say bye and it. And then I will think like, why am I wasting energy talking to him? You know, like when I could be talking to people like you. I mean, because at least you're coming here like a like a real person. You're not you're not treating me like. You're not being rude, you know. Now what what that kid is doing that is rude. Similarly, like him, there are many subscribers I have, junk subscribers, that don't even watch, don't even enjoy my content, but they just come here to waste my time and play with, play around with, with me, you know. So you, even if you did not say bye or anything like that when you are leaving, I'm not expecting you. This is not like an office. This is not a school. This is not a a, a, a college. I'm not expecting you to say bye and leave. The fact that you even considered to do that, I respect that. All right. But you're not somebody that pretends like, you know, hey, I'm a great fan or not pretending. You're just showing it with your actions. So I appreciate that. You don't have to announce your, your exit, your departure every time, bro. Just saying. That being said, I do appreciate you making time whenever you can. Hopefully everything does get sorted with you. Even if you did not become a member of my channel, that 120 rupees that you spend for me, that is still a lot of money for someone like me. You could have saved that money for your own expenses, but you decided to spend it for me and that makes me respect you a lot more, you know. Not saying that people that don't buy a membership on my channel, they are not worthy of my respect or anything. They are. Depends how they choose to engage with me. So you've taken that extra step and I can see that. So thank you, bro. I appreciate that. But th that's what I can't believe. Even though you're going through your financial difficulties, you've still decided to buy a membership. Which is not expected, definitely. Even though if you did not get a membership, bro, just know that I, I will treat you the same way. Like a proper human being. And you're always welcome here, definitely. the treasure oh, I'm not in range Yesterday that kid gave me a big headache. Very sorry to everybody that has to watch that replay. <clears throat> wasting my energy, wasting my time. Not my energy, not just my time. All the viewers time. Chutia. I will ignore that people like him from now on. <clears throat> if he stood talking to you guys respectfully in the chat then you can respond to him but if i see him cause trouble with any of you i'm just gonna ban him on the spot that is the that is all the respect he will get from me how do i get up there
<lacht> okay. What is this place? Stairwell. I don't see anything over there. What what he can do, right, Sushi? He's getting like two or three memberships over the past uh, two months for free. He can just turn off receive memberships from my channel. If he turned off that setting, the membership will go to somebody else, somebody that really needs it, you know. Because people are spending money on my channel, bro. People are not stupid, you know. People like George and all these people, they're, they're not dumb. So when they, when they decide to spend money for the channel, and if somebody's getting a free membership, if they are not a subscriber, I can understand, okay. Maybe they don't want, maybe they don't like my content, maybe they don't like me, maybe they're not interested, okay, no problem. But that guy is a subscriber, you know. That's why I was very upset at him. I don't like the fact that he has a green name because... When people have a green name in the chat, that's when I will feel like responding to them more, you know. So that kid is just playing games. Just fooling around and toying around. Free membership is a big thing, you know. So he's just uh, asking... Or at least interested... No, no, you. anyone can talk about anything in the chat, bro. It's, it's not that. Like, he's, he, the way how he's asking that question... It's like, he just want, like, I, like, some people like to do that. I don't have an issue. People can have a conversation with me. But the way how he's asking that question is like in a negative sense, you know. He's expecting some drama with my life or with the channel, which my channel is not like that. So already he has like a bad image of me and my channel, which I don't like that. So I don't have to entertain people like him. If, if the, so that clearly shows his intention, right? Why does why does he have to waste time here? He can just unsubscribe or just go somewhere. He's wasting my time. When people are watching the replay, people are going to think like, who is Anderson talking about? Who is he talking to? You know, there are people that will, after a long day at work, they will come home. They will take a bottle of beer, some pizza. They will sit by their family near the television they will turn on my stream they will have to watch it right so imagine how much i'm torturing those people because of one idiot in the chat that's what i'm saying like i'm trying to keep it professional because he has a green name i, I like subconsciously my mind is thinking okay maybe he must have paid for a membership because he has a green name a lot of people till today like past one year a lot of people even till now nobody has bought a membership i don't expect anybody to buy a membership at least the ones that have a membership, they can try to use the emojis, they can they can try to engage with the chat, have like healthy discussions, prop like ask proper questions, stuff like that. This kid is just he yesterday he came just to toy with me. I already know about him, like he's just a troll bro. Oh. That is very disrespectful, like when you take more than two or three free memberships from the channel. You don't even hang around the channel that often. If you know you're not gonna be here that often, just turn off the option. Don't no don't need to no need to take free gifted memberships. Let that go to somebody else, you know, somebody who cannot afford or somebody that does not want to pay money but they still want a membership. You know what I'm saying? So he's just trying to play with me mentally, psychological tactics. Chutia. Once he got that free game, that uh, doing that giveaway giveaway event, I don't know if you were there. He just uh, stopped coming to the channel often. That's what I'm saying. Like I've seen people like him. This is not my first YouTube channel. I used to have like two or three YouTube channels. When I when I when I wanted a subscriber so bad, that's how much I had to sacrifice. Like I would give free items. I would give like free in-game items. I would give uh, free games and stuff like that. Even then, like bastards, what they will do? They'll just steal everything, they'll run off. They won't even come back. That's why like I've stopped doing it. Hello, George, welcome. Georgie, no. 
You are the second person that tuned in. How are you? George's Ferro, George's Ferrofino, George's Falafel, George's <laughs> Ferrofil. <laughs> How are you? I'm just talking about people misusing their free gifted memberships. People being assholes. That's what I was talking about. Nothing serious. Anyway, how are you doing? It's been a while since I've seen you, but no problem. I can tell that you've been very busy. Busy bird. Just trying to finish all the leftover stuff in the game before I move on to the final mission oh there's a lion that's okay let the let the lion deal with <laughs> thanks for stopping by george how are you hope you have a good morning it's uh, 8:50 a.m over there in california Moving asshole. Oh, he <laughs> narrow escape. Why did he go in the water? Got him. So, like people like sushi, right? They they are kids. They will go around like YouTube, going to every like pe live streamers chats. Basically engaging with fake intent if there's like a giveaway or something like that They'll just take it for free, but apart from that like they will not remain a member of any streamer community You are meeting in about 10 minutes. You want to come in here and say hello. No problem, George. Hope you have a good meeting, bro Hope it goes well for you Appreciate, appreciate you stopping by uh, George has been very busy the past few days Thank you, thank you for coming by. So I've seen kids like him before. That's why, like, I didn't, I didn't like him that much. But he's still welcome here. But he's not allowed to cause trouble or dis disrupt the stream or or the chat. Thanks for the like. I appreciate it. Where am I going right now? Hold on. Uh, wait. Okay, we unlocked one of these. Let's unlock this area. This map. Hope it's not too dark. <laughs> I saw a funny comment yesterday. I thought that was a troll comment. Some guy just commented, um, I don't know if he's watching the stream, but I, I don't mind talking about it. He commented, hey, can I give you some advice? I'm like, wait, what? Is he, is he gonna say some dumb shit? Is he gonna try to piss me off? And I said, I asked him what advice and he said, Bro, you have a very nice voice. Please uh, remove, use background remover for your thumbnail. I hope you get 10 million subscribers or something like that. I saw that comment. I was like, oh, okay. You're just complimenting me. All right. I was like, okay. <laughs> and then, you know, I, I was, I said, thank you, bro. Thank you. I appreciate that. Please don't forget to hit the like button. You know, I keep thinking maybe anyone that comments on my video, like most people that comment, right? Like I've gotten used to seeing negative comments. So I anticipate it, you know, but then <laughs> when I, when I, I, like that's what, like the first thing I saw, like that was the comment I saw. This is the first thing when I woke up in the morning and I was laughing my ass off. That was very funny. Nothing wrong with that. Thanks for the hype, guys. 
Hello Travis, welcome. Everything is go good. What's going on with you? Gonna listen and work along with me. Thank you, I appreciate that. So when I saw that comment, like initially, I what I'm thinking, like, like what my thought process was, I have over 1,000 subscribers. What advice do I possibly need? But you know, it's always good to respond to feedback positively like that. So when I saw when I saw that comment, I did not know what to think of it. But it's good to respond to comments like that. And you know, bro was being a nice guy. He wasn't being a douchebag. That that made my day today. When I saw that comment on the Ghost of Tsushima stream from two weeks ago. They hardly take any damage. <clears throat> oh, this guy saw it. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Gotcha. Thank you for stopping by Travis, I appreciate it. Hope you have a good day today. Something's up there. Okay. Thanks for the likes, I appreciate it. mark over here. Easter is coming. Yeah, they will celebrate it. Uh, Easter is a big festival for them in the USA. Is this... Uh, does, this uh, does, does the stream look too dark for you? Let me know, guys. I've already bumped up the brightness by two points. So things should still be fairly visible to you. But if not, let me know. The reason why I... I wear a hat is one, I don't want this damn headset to create a dent at the back of my head. Two, some uh, like certain days during summer, the, the lights could burn my eyes. Today, like I'm feeling okay. That's why like, I don't have the hat on me. I don't, I don't, I'm not insecure about my bald head. I'm actually, in fact, I'm very proud of being bald. I don't have to hide it <clears throat> like most people out there. Summer in Chennai is, is a bitch. People that, that lived in Chennai, in Chennai city, they would know. It will burn your eyes. You'll get eye infections. You'll get all kinds of diseases. No matter how healthy you are, no matter how... Like, in, no matter if you if you eat healthy food all the time, you live in clean environments, you will still get sick living in Chennai. Uh, they will attack on sight here. Thank you, thank you, Siddharth. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up. Um, what should I start playing on Friday? Tomorrow I want to play something new. I was thinking I'll play Arkham City Hard Difficulty. I think I'll start off. Saturday as usual, Red Dead Redemption 2. Sunday I'm not sure. Sunday we're not going to be playing Demon Souls. Because we've already finished the game. George, are you here? Okay, we clear these two areas. Anything else? I don't see anything else over there. What's over here? So glad this game has fast travel. Yeah, I tried playing Dark Souls Remastered. What the hell is that game? What the hell is that game? 50-50 votes on my poll. That's what I did not know what to do. That's why I thought, okay, I'll play this game instead. 
anyhow with fortnite i'm not going to get in like any nobody likes to watch fortnite on my channel we are close to finishing this game anyway so i thought okay might as well just stream origins again you know the graphics look terrible bro even for remaster looks like looks like uh, looks terrible it's like a nightmare but um i will play it let me know if you want me to play it on sundays typical time sunday i want to play another like i want to start off a new series triple a series some new game i don't know but i think you told me to take a souls break or something <laughs> Ads in 20 seconds guys Oh, it's a lion. Uh... <coughs> Don't lion live in dens? Graphics are not great, but it was the frame rate that was terrible. There's no graphical settings in uh, remastered. In DS remastered, there's not enough graphical settings for me to tinker with. I don't mind playing it. It doesn't. For me, the gameplay matters, but definitely not a game I see getting views though when I'm streaming. I don't mind streaming it for you though, George. That's that's what I'm asking. Do you think I should stream it for you? Say the word. I will. I, I will. I'm already expecting comments. Why are you playing such an old game that looks like shit? Like a uh, typical complaint I keep getting from this area is off limits. regular viewers. Like, why are you playing games that look bad? I don't know how to answer co co uh, questions like that. <clears throat> I really want to play Dark Souls uh, Remastered. I have genuine passion. I also want to play Morrowind for fuck's sake. What do you think? Should I start playing Elder Scrolls Morrowind? Morrowind, that's my childhood game. It's like people only watch a stream if it, the Games that are being streamed are latest and they look good. Nobody wants to watch gameplay, you know. People are quick to complain. They're playing old games. Playing games that are like 20, 30 years old. Playing anything after <laughs> Demon Souls is gonna look terrible anyways. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> That's fine. 
I don't care. Before I, before I even had a PS5, I was already playing a lot of interesting games on Sundays. Like I was playing, I think I was playing Far Cry and, and stuff like that. Games that would get like really good viewership. Good viewership as in new viewership. Existing ones, I'm not really bothered about it. You know. Yeah, sure, sure. I'll be seeing you around, George. Thank you. George Sting, George Sting, yes. Yeah, game is a masterpiece, I agree. No, no, I'm not Brazilian. I'm I'm English. Nice to meet you, bro. <laughs> oh, he just bled out. Hey Machado Yeah, it looked uh, sticky over there Too many high level guards, but I am glad I got out of it the skins <laughs> why did he come here I thought that guy ran away. He came back my direction. I don't know why. Don't 
Excuse me. Last guy. Okay, uh, what else? The location here. I'm just unlocking new areas on the map. We are close to the end, uh, to the end of the game. I'm just unlocking all the question marks on the map. All the undiscovered areas. Exploring, you know. They were all sitting near the fuel. All I had to do was throw a firebomb, that's it. Imagine how this game would be in hard or nightmare difficulty. Almost level 40. Five 
position. I should be cautious around here. And nobody heard him scream. That's the sad part. in the eardrum how do I get down there oh this way <laughs> Not betray the black land, despots. Are you Gupta? Uh, yes. Did Apollodora send you? Uh, no matter. We must escape. <laughs> Help me, please. You cannot let me rot in this cage. Oh, I cannot thank you enough. Imbecile. 
Lung servat onus descendus. Incumbite et lung finis, bastardos! The socket must be. Roma is no friend to our people of the Nile. She will crush us beneath her sandal. How did you know of me, Magi? The Centurion's list led me to you, and another of your comrades at the fort. Apollodorus will want to know that we are compromised, and a Roman invasion of the Black Lands inevitable. Thank you, Magi, for Egypt. For a free Egypt. May our victories multiply. Nice, that's all. That was easy. I only had to rescue him. Fate is the king. Can I get that guy? Oh, I got him. He's quite far away from me. Bike is a beast.
Please don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe so you don't miss out on any content. So many camps everywhere. Are you fucking kidding me bro? I got I died to fire? That is so lame. All this time I was alive. Imagine dying so pathetic like that. That's a lot of damage. Be careful now. That was weird. Such a sad way to die. Almost level 40. going on over there Ambush. I should have been on my horse. Big mistake.
We are an hour into the stream. How can I assist you? Thank you for being here, guys. I appreciate you. Okay. Look how far away the reinforcements are. Pathetic. Why did he get in my way? Look at how many areas are there?
Ja, ein neuer, ne? Forty. What? I didn't kill the boss. Okay, okay.
for the commander. He may be carrying important information. Ah, this may tell me what their plan is. What? I will destroy these carts, and Jibade will soon meet Anubis. Mm. Αφροσύνης. 
Okay, time to upgrade my weapons. Get out of the way! No! 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 the other two.
bad day must be somewhere in this fortress. It wasn't... Now to destroy the carts. Huh? Hey, wait! Bring him down! <laughs> die, die! Hey, hold on! Eat this! That will cost you! <laughs> Ho, oh, oh. ho! Yeah. Fucking dumb logic. They can chase me all they want. Ain't gonna stop me.
So much for their bribery. Very well. I've done what I can. Now I will see Otis in Alexandria. He may have found out what this is all about. Thank you, thank you, Travis. I appreciate that.
All you know who he brought. Clear off! What do you think you are doing? Get out of the way! These bandos. What would they bring the home in a Wait a minute! What are all these soldiers doing here? I must be careful. What has happened here? This body. Oh, I fear it is Otis. Wearing the robes of a scribe. Ah, it is indeed Otis. Poor man. Signs of torture. Someone tried to make him talk. Poor girl. One of the servants. Scrolls about the palace budgets. Nothing of interest. Letters and papers from the royal palace. Ah, nothing of use here. They were determined to leave no witnesses. He was attacked in the... <clears throat> Hidden notes. Must be important. You did fine work to gather this information, Otis. As you traverse the Duat, I swear to you, if I get the chance, I will make certain this General Rufio pays. Best not to draw attention here. Το 
Oh, what great facts, George. Nice, thank you. 23, 24. Isn't that interesting? George. Make it look so easy, huh? All these headshots, all all the fights and shit. It's like years of playing this game. It's coming back to me, muscle memory. Cool voice, yeah. But he 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 did a great performance in this game. Subscribe so you don't miss out on any content. George's fellow Phil. Yeah, carry on, carry on. Have your breakfast, bro. Enjoy it. Hope you have a good one. Yummy one. Yummy Georgino meal. Some Georgino filafil. Oh, that is the arena. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you hopefully you get the time to play this game. <laughs> Content wise, like you won't get a lot of views, but definitely a game worth playing once in a once in a lifetime like it depends you know i know a lot of people that stream this game they don't get uh, they don't get views i mean they do get views but not a lot so if you if you want to create content off of this game i would say it's uh, it's a bad idea I did not expect to see you here. <laughs> I'm just running around doing shit, you know. Just on your own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I'm just stating the possibility, George. George's fellow Fino. DLCs, I think there are two DLCs, yeah. I still haven't started playing the DLC part of the game yet. A lot more content, like an, an, addi an additional 25-30 hours. Both uh, both DLCs in, uh, included. What, what do you think about Morrowind, George? <clears throat> I 
Do you think it's a game that you would like to see on my channel? Just wondering. I mean, I'll try installing some HD mods and stuff like that before I start streaming, surely. I've never actually got to finish the game. I did finish Oblivion, Skyrim. I didn't finish Morrowind ever. It's a really hard game. I'm not gonna play that. Yeah, on the Skyrim engine? Nah. I won't play that version. I'll play the native Morrow Morrowind engine version. Only thing is like I'll change a few mods here and there. That's it. Game still looks ugly to people watching. They're gonna have to put up with it. No choice. My whole life I've been trying to do a playthrough of that game. I would love to do it on the channel. Hello Mike Mangold, welcome. Good morning. Hope you have a good day. I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you, thank you. Okay, my dinner is here. Let me go pick it up. I'll be back. Give me two minutes, guys. Enjoy the scenery. Yeah, Mike is here. Everybody say hello to Mike. Thank you, George. Appreciate you guys being here. Thank you so much. You people are awesome. These icons are blinding.
Thank you. Am I going for 100%? There's no percentage tracker in the game, so I can't tell even if I do everything. If I do all the side activities, I, I unlock every hidden location. I loot every tomb, underwater wreckage and all that. I can't tell if I have actually done 100%. The game doesn't let me know anywhere, you know, in, this, in the options menu or anywhere that I'm, like, what my current progress is. All I'm just gonna do is just open up the map and if I see a question mark or any undiscovered location, I'm just gonna head straight to it and clear it. That's what I'm doing right now. After I finish everything, then I'll I'll officially do the final mission of the main story and end the series. How can the guy see me? desire to get back to size. Size? I have a fear. You will pay, folks. Weaklings. Ah, he saw me, motherfucker. <laughs> you can break through that? I didn't know. Penetrated.
Okay, what? I'm down. Not one man I'm leaving alive. It's so funny. So funny, George. Didn't I come here before? Yeah, chopping the things. <laughs> yeah, George, you you know me well. What did he say? Did he say I won't forget you, dog? They they spoke in Ebonics uh, slang even way back in uh, the BC days. Huh. Interesting. Okay, I think that's that. Uh, what's over there? What you eating over there, George? Let us in on the secret. What you gorging on there, George? <laughs> nah, I'm just teasing you, bro. Enjoy it, enjoy it. You don't have to say it, bro. You don't, don't have to say it. Tuna salad eating with some crackers. Oh, nice. Sounds yummy. Whoa. Enjoy it. Enjoy it, George. Treat yourself. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Carry on, George. Thank you.
you win. Ads in 15 seconds, guys. Oh, is that a uh, serial killer? <laughs> Poor man. You did not deserve to be dragged underwater by these hippos. And it appears you are prepared for the afterlife by a clumsy butcher with no thumbs. Where's your liver? Poor man. You did not deserve to be dragged underwater by these hippos. And it appears you are prepared for the afterlife by a clumsy butcher with no thumbs. Where's your liver? I suspect the sarcophagus was transported by cart. It is inscribed to the mark of circuit, the scorpion goddess. But where is the body? You are two hours in the stream. I appreciate you all. Thank you. Thanks for being here. This perverse poetry celebrates chaos. It invites all that is divine and just. Oh, I already know that, bro. And it appears you are prepared for the afterlife by a clumsy butcher with no thumbs. Where's your liver? Oh, the silly game. I, we both have the same haircut. Who? Uh, Bayek and me. Yeah, we do. Hello, Rossi. How are you? I might end the stream early just so I can watch Apocalypto. How are you? Hope you had a good day. Hope you have a good day. Thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you always, brother. How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? Thank you for the shaka. I appreciate it. How is your thing? Thank you thank you yeah i did bring it up on my streams i think before no no i didn't bring it up on my stream i brought it up in my workplace okay okay what a coincidence i was talking about that movie to my students in my class and you brought it up on discord today thank you thank you for reminding me bro i appreciate you yeah, George is at work right now. He can't hear the audio. I do appreciate him being here. I can hear some sound. He had some tuna salad and crackers for breakfast.
Don't tell him I'm making fun of him, all right? That's cool. I don't mind reading stuff. I like it, Rossi. <laughs> I got the clue. Someone came here with a heavily laden cart and left the same way. Though the second track looks lighter. This happened recently. And the cart may not have traveled far. There may be more to this mystery nearby. Those responsible should not be allowed to do this again. Should I start Arkham City tomorrow? Tomorrow as in 12 hours from now? What do you think, Crossy? I already have the game installed. Okay, then I think I shall begin. Hello, Jack Marston. Yeah, because Batman, yep. Appreciate you stopping by, thank you. That game also will be played in hard difficulty. Sarcophaga inscribed with the mark of circuit. How much death does she require? Mm. What is that sound? Voices? Ghosts? Demons? I need to find the source of the chanting. Mysterious killings have led here. This symbol is old. This place is from a long time lost.
What is this insolence? Who dares to intrude upon our most sacred work? Sacred? A trail of death led me here. This cavern reeks of the profane. Are you the bloody hand responsible? The goddess Serket is she who tightens the throat and the one who lets us breathe. I do her will. I am her sting. All of the souls were chosen from lesser faiths. But we study their organs and read the signs. Soon we will know Serket's secrets and become immortal. This was your last chance to win the goddess's favor. Let's test your immortality, shall we? Things of a madman. Uh, oh, I arrived too late to save this one. You will be the last victim of this cursed ritual. The ri yeah, finally I finished this mission. Took me years. Now I know how it ends. Yeah, many missions. Papa, when you met Mother, how did you know she liked you? My heart lit on fire, of course. She smiled at me, and her eyes rendered me helpless. So if a girl likes you, she smiles at you? Son, there are some things I can't explain to you. The stars, how to fight, but this is, is something not even the gods can tell. You will have to ask a goddess. Athor, goddess of motherhood and joy. She is loved by all in Egypt, from the least to the greatest, mistress of the West. She welcomes the dead to the afterlife. You have many missions taking years. <laughs> The stream crashed for a while, my bad. Don't know why. It's okay, we are back online. How am I gonna finish this? Looks like a person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a head. It's... That's what I'm trying to find out. I need to align this with the stars. 
How are you doing, by the way? How are you doing? I see. You guys, how are you all doing? I think I got it. Happy to know, happy to know. Nice to know, nice to know you guys are doing well. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for all the support you've shown. All the gifted memberships you've... You've uh, contributed, to, uh, contributed to the channel, uh, Rossi. Appreciate you. Even though you didn't have to do that, Auntie. Wait, why am I going back? Oh no. I've already done it. I pressed the button by mistake. Oh, okay. That was strange. My bad, my bad. How long is Apocalypto? Is it... It's a long movie, right? It's more than three hours, I think. Three hours or four hours. Okay, okay. I'll see if I can watch it later today. Maybe not because I have to you need to stream in the morning, you know, for you guys. Morning is evening time for you. For me, next morning is evening time for you. If it's two hours, then I think I can watch it tonight. Let's see. the treasure <clears throat> oh there it is I see it so many hyenas in there
been at this for hours. Shall we go visit a uh, pyramid? Remember, Rossi was talking about it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Time has come. Have I tried the poison darts or bows with the poison effect? Poison 3 or 4 guys starts to change reaction again. I mean, my aim is pretty good and my weapons are leveled up properly, so I haven't seen the need to use any poison in the game. Because, like, the bow and arrow already are quite OP. So, it's something worth considering. Definitely, definitely. I do have ability points. Thanks for reminding me. Uh, check. I don't think I have it unlocked. No, I don't have it unlocked. Okay. Yeah, you need a lot of skill points to unlock the dots. But, uh, yeah. Okay, I'll start unlocking it. Thank you. Thank you, Jack. Good thing you brought that up in the chat. I'm already overpowered with my sword, my spear, my bow. So I, I haven't felt the need to use anything else, you know. That's why. Whoa. If I was lagging behind, you know, in terms of level and stuff like that, if, if I was having trouble trying to defeat a few enemies, then definitely I would have considered using my tools. Tools don't deal a lot of damage in this game. I think maybe in the future Assassin's Creed games, like Odyssey or Valhalla. But in this one, all you need is a bow. Like a good leveled bow, a good leveled sword and spear. You can take down any enemy you want. Oh, I hate climbing the pyramids. Great conductor, yes. With the darts, all you need is a bush to hide in. Like even when I when enemies go full alert on me, all I gotta do is pull out my bow and shoot them all. Like that's how good my aim is. So I just aim for the head and they all die within like milliseconds. I have like five enemies running at me. Like I can still take them down with a bow. I don't even need a sword or, or a spear. That's how easy I feel like this game is. For a beginner player, definitely they like, they, you know, it's it would be complicated. But I have it's I've played I've been playing this game for a few years now, so it's mostly muscle memory, you know. We'll be starting Batman tomorrow. Tomorrow as in 10 hours from now, 9 to 10 hours from now. Oh, I love the way this thing glows. The tip of this pyramid, I, I think it's made of gold. Look at that, look at that shine. Look at that finishing. <gasps> Looks so good. The reason why you gave me a bow in Green Hill. Yeah, yeah. The first arrow I think I got, the first kill I got was a headshot. On a capybara. What fool would set up camp out here? I should have a look. Yeah, I'm good at stuff like that, but I'm not good at survival stuff. Like, I, I don't know how to collect food, I don't know how to build a hut, shit like that I suck ass, definitely. But you can trust me with a weapon in, in, a, in any video game, most video games that is. Yeah, he, uh, Rossi's camp mom. I can't wait to play with Patrick. <laughs> oh, we are gonna have a hell of a time.
What's happening here? Bandit attack. Like I think button. that guy's gonna Subscribe die before so I even get there. I think we should start a new one because Patrick is joining. I don't want to make it complicated, so I think we'll start a new save. I don't mind starting a new save. It's all good, no problem. It doesn't have a lot of viewership anyway, so I don't think anyone's gonna give a shit if we restart the story again. I think people enjoy watching... Watching me banter with the rest of you guys. I don't think anyone, like the, the current audience that I have as of now, I, I don't think anyone gives a shit if I wipe if I wipe out my progress and restart or if I continue the existing progress. But if I had like over 5,000 subscribers or something like that, people will get mad. Like, why are you starting a new save? But I think, I think, uh, like, are you, do you use weapons often in the game, Rossi? How often do you use weapons? Okay. So, which means, you should be the host. I think you should create the, the save because you're from the USA. And now Patrick is playing with you. Both of you should not have any ping problems. So I will join. Which means my ping will be slightly higher. And I'll be having trouble aiming and getting my shots off. But that's okay. I'll deal with it. Okay, I'll go to the bathroom now. I'll be back in two minutes. Thanks for waiting, guys. I appreciate you. I'll be in the chat with you. No, I host. Why? Ah, if I host, uh, oh, you need my arrow strong? Okay, that's what I was asking. All right, I'll be back, guys. Thanks for being here. Thanks for being patient. I appreciate you.
I'm back. Thanks for being here, guys. I appreciate you. Uh, I, me and Patrick can go <laughs> while you make up. That's cute. That's adorable, Rossi. Thank you. Also gather bandages for... <laughs> Uh, you, you real funny, huh? You're very funny, Rossi. Just got a new subscriber from Brazil. I could not understand him. He was type, he was typing in Brazil, but he did a, he, he did say masterpiece of a game in English when he dropped by into this uh, like uh, for the stream. Yeah, he spoke in Portuguese. Yeah. Yeah, it's quite close to Spanish, I agree. He asked me if I was Brazilian, I said no, I'm not. I speak English. Um, what is that? Did I come here before? Oh, I think I did, yeah. Retransmission, segment three. Acquiring contemporaneity. It has been 95 days since the great catastrophe. The messenger speaks. You must be wondering why I have reached out to you. It was written, you see, that you would come to this particular chamber at this very moment in time. The walls told us of your coming when we once were. Look at them. Are they not fascinating? One of here. You walk with here. Hmm? These walls tell of a tragic story. A story we transcribed in our structures, on our artifacts. A story we cannot alter. A mystery defying us in plain sight. We tried. Our scholars and scientists. Poets and physicists, bright minds, rebellious hearts. They all tried so hard to bring about change. They, we all failed. None could change what we discovered, the stories written into the walls of these rooms. By whom, we never knew. We know they tell of the future that is, the future that was, and the future that is yet to come. The zeros? We failed at modifying the line. We failed at adding a single dot. It was clear we were to be messengers at best. But messengers to whom? To you. We removed our ability to read those stories from your original template. Oh, how long is he gonna keep talking? A doorway that is also a puzzle. We must find the solution. Those were Brutus's words when he visited the vault under the Colosseum more than 2,000 years ago. He drew the vault, sketched it to the best of his abilities, but he could not see. Just as you are blind, you may read your watch, you may read hourglasses and calendars, but you cannot grasp beyond that simplistic surface. For now, the true reading of time still escapes you. And so today, the curtains pulled and the earth is shown, tragic and complete. Wow, how long is this dialogue, bro? Those walls you might never read. Events yet unfold as written, but something. I don't have time for this shit. Change. 
Fucking non stop, bro. This guy's talking. Give me my tablet. Rashi, are you here? Rashi, Flinklidge. I had a troll yesterday in my chat and uh, to your surprise it's not even somebody that's new that just subscribed that is like a hater or anything. It was a regular member that, that was gifted a membership that asked, uh, that asked a really dumb question. I don't know if you were there when this, when this was happening on yesterday's uh, origin stream. Why do he miss the trolls? Oh, uh, well... Bad timing, I guess, but it's fine. So, he asked a question, like, I know he doesn't... I don't expect everybody to be here for my streams all the time, I get it. Uh, everybody's gonna behave differently, but I can tell, like, people that are here authentically, and people that are here with with genuine intent and i can tell the people that are just faking it you know people that seem like they like enjoy my content they enjoy me as a personality you know i guess you can say that i'm insecure or something but whatever you know i think i have a right to uh distance myself from people that i feel are not trustworthy enough for me so this guy, like I know he doesn't come often to my streams. I mean, you, you know I stream every day, alright? Not everybody... People have things happening in their lives, I get it, alright? Uh, let me mute the audio because if I come here, he's gonna start fucking running his mouth. This, this, um... Uh, imaginary character. Alright, so... Um... I get that, alright? So... When people don't tune into streams, they don't follow my content often, it's their fault. I don't have to explain everything that's going on with me and my life. Like, let's just say if somebody, there's one person who used to come to my streams often, but then later on they, you know, something happens to them. Like maybe they have like a medical emergency, maybe something new happened in their, in their life and they, ha they, they don't have time to watch my streams. I, I get it, all right? So they won't be able to be, they won't be able to tune in to my channel for like a month or two months and then they'll come after a few months have progressed and then they'll come and they'll see me streaming one fine day and um, they'll be like hey how are you and uh, oh, it's been a while since I've been here like nice to see you've grown by a couple of subscribers and how's everything and you know like basic conversation I can I don't mind engaging with people like that you know because you know there are those kinds of people and then there's the other kind who do not have any interest whatsoever like they are just subscribed just to see me fail you know what i mean like they they just want to see me collapse or like they so it's like hate you know they are haters but they don't fucking like they they are just subscribed just to follow they're just waiting for like a massive screw up from my end you know so yesterday I had this person who was not tuning in for like a few um, streams, alright, and the way how, like, you, typically whenever people come into my chat after, like, a specific period of Please time, don't forget to hit the like you know, button. not having so uh, on any content. Uh, been tuned to my streams often, they would, you know, typically like how they would ask questions like, how are you doing, how's everything with you, like, that's how they would talk to me, like any regular human being that's how they would talk to me this guy like he was on a whole nother level like, he just comes in the chat and the first thing he says is like uh, hey uh, so anything new happened with you in your life something interesting something unexpected that question was completely like it caught me off guard it was like the dumbest question that i've ever like legit the way how he's asking me that question the way how the question is framed it was designed to make me look guilty of some wrongdoing, you know, like he wants me to say something uh, unintentionally, you know, like, like therefore trying to embarrass myself on, on my own stream. 
So I asked him like, why, why should I have to answer you that question? You know, because I don't mind embarrassing myself, bro. Like nothing wrong with it. But the fact that it's coming from a regular subscriber, like somebody that's been tuning in whenever they can, like that too with a gifted membership, they have a green name on, on, on the, on the, on their account, whenever they type in the chat. That legit really upset me. Like, why would someone ask a dumbass question like that, you know? So I told him I don't have to answer. Uh, so we had like a back and forth banter for like 30 minutes straight. It was really painful to watch. I went back and watched the, I rewatched the stream again. Watching the exchange between me and this, this kid. And it was so painful to sit through. I was like, what the fuck am I doing? Why am I talking to this kid, you know? I don't want to ignore people like that because they like he does come in and hit the like button he does try to talk as much as he can but usually like he'll only be here for like five minutes or ten minutes and he will just say okay i gotta go bye gotta go like the way how he types is so fucking like disrespectful you know it really pisses me off so i had to ask him like uh you know like why do you want to know that and he's like no i'm just asking bro and i i, I told him i don't want to answer your question because there's like plenty of other people that come into my chat there's plenty of other meaningful questions that people ask me plenty of other conversations that, that i can get into so what you're asking is really a dumbass question i don't want to waste my oxygen replying to you because like you know i'm not i'm the kind of streamer that doesn't want to keep like mouthing off you know yapping yapping is flapping his gums all the time let me unmute, unmute the audio because I think we are in a different place now. That's quiet. So, yes or no? Open-ended questions. Yeah, but I can't tell like what his intent was. Like, was he? But I can tell he was. Tr he was trying to troll me. It did not. Did not work accordingly in his favor. Now, if it's somebody I don't even know, like, I don't give a shit. I would ban them on the spot. Like, I would just time them out. Usually, like, it's always Astros that, that come into the stream. But there are nice people that do come in, you know. So, I can tell based on, like, the overall vibe and the, the aura, how they how they approach the, the stream. It tells me everything, all right. I'm not that dumb. I've been on the internet for long enough. I can tell, like, the way how people type. It it does set set the tone, you know. So I'm not that dumb. This kid is like 17, 16 years old. All right. Oh, I got the tablet. Nice. So uh, he he's like, uh, I'm sorry if I've upset you. I'm sorry if you're angry at me. I'm just uh, uh, wondering. I told him, bro, I know that you're, you're just, you're not. I told him, you're not a. You would have taken it as an interesting way of asking. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I thought like I would consult this with you. I don't care if it's a public stream. Let any anybody watch this. Anyone can watch this. Uh, watch this. I don't give a shit. But but I do know how people come to my stream and how they approach. You know, so I'm always on guard all the time. Yes, you can call me paranoid or I'm insecure, whatever the case is. But what people need to keep in mind is that I'm trying to have a clean stream. That if anyone was going to rewatch in a replay, I want to make sure like. It's, it's clean, you know, there's no bullshit happening during the gameplay. There's not a lot of interruptions. There's no idiots in the chat that, that come in. You know what I mean? So, I feel like it's fair enough. Like, if it's a troll, they're not welcome here, right? So, you know, keeping my guard up is not wrong. Exactly. So, I just called him out on, on his bullshit behavior, though. That's what I did. I, I felt like I could have... Writing. From the old kingdom. I could have handled it differently, but considering like he's also like I was doing a giveaway uh, giveaway event that even I did not even organize. All right, it was Edward that organized it. He hit me up in Discord and he he told me let's do like a giveaway for Lethal Company, you know. And I think even you were there, RC. So this kid like he he was quite depressed all right he really wanted the game he was talking to me on my streams like how much he wanted the game so i thought okay maybe i'll just give him the game i'll just contact edward and i'll tell him to gift him the game add him on steam gift him the game and that's that what this happened on the first week of january all right once he, that kid got the game he hasn't been showing up to my streams often now do keep in mind i think that day we gifted like two or three copies that is somebody's hard-earned money all right so I know Edward doesn't 
really mind all about that but it's still coming from my community you know edward does represent my community so once this kid got the game he completely stopped tuning into my streams often wouldn't you say like that is complete that is disrespectful in the slightest bit so he'll only come here and he'll just say hi but if if there's not anything interesting happening in the stream like say if there's no drama or if there's no arguments happening in the chat if it's like a regular normal chill stream he will immediately fuck off he'll just say something along the lines hey uh, i'm just going by you know i'm done this and that you're taking it as a creative mind yeah but you you do not know the person i'm i monitor most of the people that come into my chat good people and douchebags are like so i don't know you know what i mean so i'm not trying to dismiss your your statement but from my perspective you have to think like how many things i'm juggling at once you know i i have to focus on the gameplay i've got to read the chat i've got to keep a conversation going so if you if you're just a troll just fuck off like i i don't have to re waste my time reading shit if you if you're going to be a troll if you're going to type something stupid in the chat you want me to do something for you you either super chat or you become a member that way i know you're serious you you really want me to do, to do something because i'm not going to deviate from my original streaming agenda you know so if if i if i want to play a game a certain way that's how i'm going to play it respond to how they type that's what i'm saying the way how he was typing was like kind of mocking me you know like usually like he, he could have asked it like a normal person he could have asked it like uh hey how are you doing what's going on with you it's been a while and i would have been like yeah everything is fine all is good but the way how he framed the question was completely disrespectful so i just called him out bro just don't waste my fucking time if you are not tuning into the streams often it's your fault and nobody here owes you an answer as to what's going on with the channel or with their lives i told him that and i also told him you are receiving free gifted memberships at least 3 times in the past 2 months not even once you have bothered being in uh, being in the chat and i told him i because it's misleading you know i keep seeing his name in green i keep thinking like he's a paying member or he's somebody that's coming to the channel often now if it's a non subscriber that's receiving the gifted membership i could care less all right because they'll get an email and it's up to them whether they want to subscribe or not if they subscribe at least i know they will try to come in often um but this kid right like he's been completely dismissing the gifted memberships and i told him i would prefer like if somebody else got the gifted membership and not you because there's a lot of people waiting in line people that cannot afford to buy a membership people that i'm like holding off you know like you don't have to buy memberships guys you don't you don't have to spend money on the channel if somebody gives a membership maybe then hopefully you people are lucky to lucky enough to receive a gifted membership you know i don't want you guys spending money because that's not what that's not what my channel is all about so it's annoying like like it, don't get me wrong like i'm happy when people do give memberships on the channel you know but it's so annoying to see people that are banned receiving memberships you always care where your gifts land exactly so it keeps going to that kid again and again I, and I, i told him just turn off receive gifts from my channel because i would prefer if it went to somebody else meaningful to me you know no offense to him because he's not tuning into the streams often so i think it's it's normal for me to expect a gifted membership to reach somebody that does genuinely want to support the channel right so his answer like after like we had this back and forth argument mike was there mike and a few of them were there sidat was there and his answer was bro i don't have time to sit and watch for full 4 hours of of your fucking stream i got to pl uh, play video games i said yeah i know you don't have time so why are you pretending like you're a loyal supporter or like a loyal fan don't fucking waste my time don't waste anybody's time you don't have to you, what you can do is come in the chat you can say hello everybody will see that you're saying hello whether you want to have a conversation or not that's fine 
but legit asking me what's going on so that you can try to you know bait me into saying like there's something bad going on maybe i'm going through some tough time in my life trying to bait me into giving like a long descriptive answer for like assholes that could tune in and re like re watch the replay and just sit back and laugh because definitely if i'm going through a bad time it's it's like it's it's i'm giving i'm giving gold to my haters i don't want that you know if, if i'm going through a bad time the people that know me like like you rossi like in discord server you're in my discord server you talk to me on discord often like you would know what's going on with me but i don't i don't have to like the the the, the biggest problem i had with this kid was he was like so persuasive about it He's like I want to know, I want to know, I want to know. So when you keep poking the stick in the same spot over and over again, that is not good, right? Like that is trolling, right? And that's what I did not like about him. And I just called him out. See, you're not you're not even here. You're not in engaging in like an organic viewer. So just don't waste anybody's time. That, that's what I that's what I told him. Once he got the game for free, that gear Edward gifted him for free. He com like he completely fucked off. <laughs> I I mean I I saw it coming. It's nothing new, you know. But I I just thought like okay, he would be grateful, he would be nice about it, you know. And then you uh okay, I I get that. And he's like, "Oh, so you want me to sit and watch your streams every day?" I No, I didn't say it like that. Don't what I'm saying is don't pretend like you're sitting and watching my streams for 4 hours a day. Don't do that. What you can do is come in you can say hi have like a tiny conversation with the people that that you feel like talking to or you feel like engaging within the chat and then you can quietly leave you don't you don't have to say anything like he will just come in and within the first 5 minutes after coming into the stream after saying hi like okay i got to go back i'm Whoa. bye got to go like so fucking rude and dismissive bro you can just quietly leave right you don't have to don't have to say anything So he's doing it in a way like where he deliberately wants to annoy me, you know. Like I know you're not interested in watching the stream. Just don't don't pretend like you give a damn. That's what I'm saying. Hello Dustin, welcome. So I had to call him out. And then you know what he uh, when uh, when I brought up the fact that he got a free gifted game from me and a couple of gifted memberships from you and George. Um He's like why did you give it to me then did i ask for it you see that attitude that he's got I'm like really bro like you you are not you're not even going to be the the least bit grateful that my community are, are willing to do good things for you so that is like that's what i'm saying he's got that typical teenager the teenage angst you know the typical teenage attitude like hey why should i do this or why should i do that So that's when I caught him. That's when I I I caught him red-handed. Okay. Now this is I already know that you are this kind of a piece of shit person. You don't have to pretend anymore. Now you you you've revealed yourself. Whoa. <clears throat> He just wouldn't drop the topic. Thanks for the like, Dustin. I appreciate it. He wouldn't drop drop the topic. I I told him, "Forget about it." All right. I I I've called you out. I know your mindset. No need to pretend like you you come here all the time. Whenever you do come in here, just say you know say hello and you can leave no problem. But don't pretend like you're some die hard fan of me. That's like you you know you you think of me every day. You drop pictures of me on 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 your wall. No no need. No need like that that's the kind of pretentious behavior that this kid was doing. I just called him out. No need for that. Just be a normal person. I'm not going to be upset at you. If you're being normal, everybody in my chat is normal. Not everybody is like claiming to be a die-hard fan of me. Everybody is a normal person here. Nobody is uh, claiming that they are a die-hard fan of me. No, but nobody does that. It's it's completely like fake-ass behavior that I cannot stand. <laughs> yeah, like I was rewatching that whole portion and I I got a headache. Like, damn, why did I spend so much time talking to this stupid-ass kid? I could have had so many other conversations maybe I could have kept quiet and played the 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 game while streaming Just you know completely sabotaging the stream I I hate people like that Seriously bro 
And after uh, after he left the the stream, he he wrote a big ass fucking essay in my Discord DM, which I should have deleted him on Discord also. I added him on Steam because uh, me and Edward we had uh, Edward had to gift him the game, so I had to check his account. Already um, he his account was his Steam account was looking very suspicious to me because he had a Counter Strike uh, loot box trading website name on it so he is participating in gambling now gambling is something i don't like if if people like doing it okay fine but i don't i don't encourage that on my channel i don't talk about it all right so that was already quite fishy to me then i called him out you got time to do all this gambling shit So basically, this kid, what he's doing is he's advertising a scummy website. So he wants to play Counter Strike all uh, like every day for at least twelve hours a day. That's why he doesn't want to watch my streams. You there? Is that a magi badge? That is comeback behavior, right? I just called him out on it. Get me out of here. If if I didn't know that about him, I would not have bothered asking him about it. But I know that. So he's trying to play that he's a good guy or something. No need, bro. His username is yeah Counter Strike exactly. No, I like Counter Strike. Don't get me wrong, but I will never have a username like a Steam username where I promote some other illegal gambling website. You know, why would I want to do that? So I don't know if he's making money off of it, like if he's scamming anybody on the internet. But that like it's it's so annoying. Like when when he comes here, he's like uh, yeah I'm watching your stream. He's not like he'll just leave within the first five minutes. He'll go. He'll go to go back to Counter Strike to scam everybody. And also, what this kid is doing, I've discovered a pattern from this kid. What he will do is like he'll claim to be depressed. You know, he'll claim to have like a mental disorder or something. And he'll try to enter giveaways like live stream giveaways. He'll try to take shit for free, free skins, free costumes, free Steam items and stuff like that. That's why I didn't like that kid, bro. That's why I called him out. But I wish I hadn't done it. I've given like I've wasted so much energy on that kid. Like you would keep saying, right, Rossi? No need for wasted energy. Yeah, wasted. Yeah, feel so bad about it. Ads will be playing right now. So much time being wasted. It's not worth it. So, how do you think I should have handled the situation once he came in the chat asking a stupid question like that, which I already know like he's not. Interested in watching my content, but he's just pretending like he's somebody that gives a damn. How do you think I should have responded to it? Is what I'm trying to ask you. I I wanted to give you like a brief insight as to what happened, and then see what you have what do you have to say now. Oh, that guy died easily. Maybe I should become one of those channels that ask for super chats before I answer a question or some shit. Yeah, I should be one of those. Simple, brother. If the converse starts going like that, ask the question: What is your goal here? What are you trying to accomplish? That's that's exactly what I asked, bro. Exactly, in a similar frame, I asked him the same exact fucking thing. Dude just kept dragging the damn conversation. Fucking asshole. 
There are, there are grown ass adults watching my content, rewatching my content. People with lives, people with families, people that have health problems, real health problems. This asshole just comes in and tries to sabotage it, which he successfully did it by oh. the way. Stop and play the game. Okay, okay, exactly. The reason why I'm responding to, to that moron is because, because he's got a green name on his, on his username. That's why. I keep thinking like he's a member, but he's not. Just a wolf in sheep's clothing. Piece of shit. A hidden entrance. How long has this been here? I I wish YouTube gave me an option to remove memberships from accounts that are, that have received gifted memberships and reassign those memberships to people that I want. Uh, if you guys are gifting memberships to the channel, don't get me wrong. Like I'm 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 extremely grateful to all of you guys. Gifting memberships, super chatting and all that, which I, I never ask anybody for any money on my channel. Everybody knows that. All right. I don't want to come off as an asshole saying this, but I feel like I have a right to choose who exactly the membership should go to, you know? After saying this, let me know when you're done. Okay. Yeah, I should have done that. I should have done that. My mistake. He's trying to make me vulnerable on my own stream. That's, I could clearly tell that was his intention. I, I and also I, I, YouTube should offer an option where, like, if you guys are about to gift one membership or no matter how many, you should be able to choose who, whether it should be random, pseudo random, or if it should go to selected number of people, like it should have like a, uh, Tick box or something, you know, like pull up names in the in 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 like a box up to like 50, 100 names, and you get to choose. You have like a little search search bar in there. You can type the name. Out of hundred people, have like one name pop up. Select, tick that box. That's one gifted membership. You and then you you click on send gift. It'll send. Like I wish YouTube had an option like that. I'm getting tired of like assholes. Getting gifts for free, like people that have already banned on the channel, trolls or, you know, it's getting really frustrating. Don't get me wrong, like... Ah, a dead end. Does not make sense. Or oh, there must be a way forward. 70% of the super chats and gifted memberships and memberships, they do go to me, alright? 70% of the revenue, that, like, the, 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 the price that you pay, like, it does come to me, alright? Don't get me wrong, you're still, you guys are still supporting me. But I feel like if it went to people that actually do tune in often, that would like to use the emojis, engage with the chat, you know, engage with the stream as a viewer, I feel like it would do a lot. Going like, it's like a waste going, it's okay if it even goes to non-subscribers because at least non-subscribers, they'll get an email, you know, hey, you got a gift to membership from this channel. Welcome to this community and stuff like that. But imagine like being a subscriber or being somebody that's banned, someone that's not welcome to the channel. <laughs> And they keep getting it again and again. Like I, I get so like I don't show it. Whenever it happens, like whenever George or you give memberships, and I see a name I don't like seeing, like I, I don't like seeing a certain name or like a certain douchebag get it. I get like a headache immediately. I just don't show it. <laughs> Here's another one. If I get someone opening in chat like that again. Ah, okay, okay. It's funny. Rossi is giving me tips on how to interact with. Potential trolls in the chat. I will take your advice seriously, bro. Nothing wrong with that. For me, streaming is already hard as it is, bro. Like, I'm sitting for three to five hours a day streaming. So, I feel like people should have some common sense, right? Like, if they're gonna come and ask in the chat. Because you can clearly, like, mouse over, hover over the, the, the play bar. You can see, like, I'm streaming for, like, quite a long time. Like, it's exhausting for me, you know? So I'm just trying to chill with people that I know. I'm trying to provide good content for for oh, everybody. By a moon. What is this? People think they can just walk over me, you know, like treat me like garbage. If you're going to treat me like garbage, I will treat you like garbage. Simple as that. Equal exchange. I'm not obliged to be nice to anybody. You can dislike the the anything on the channel. Cry about whatever you want in the comments. It doesn't hurt me one bit. But if you're gonna be a troll, at least let me know that you're you you you're somebody that doesn't like me, you know. 
or somebody that's not here in with good with good intentions so that I can ban you or time you out I can I can have fun with you so that people in the chat can toy with you insult you berate you <laughs> you know what I'm saying if you're gonna be a nice person be a nice person I've been in streams like where it's like chat has been toxic like channels where they have million subscribers I've been in in the chats of big streams where the mods are being douchebags to the viewers also but once I come in there with like the positive energy I say hi to everybody I I wish everybody a good day you know immediately like it changes like the whole energy in the changes like everybody starts talking to me they respond to me you know and I try to keep regular appearances That yeah, like it's it's fun, but it takes one asshole in the chat to fucking completely derail the stream, bro. One moron. That's what I don't like at all, you know. Not trying to not trying to discriminate. Uh, viewers, oh, only uh, Anderson is only gonna read uh, green names in the chat. He's only gonna respond to green names. No, respond. I respond to everybody. As long as whatever you you type in chat makes sense, is worthy of an answer, is you know it's it's typed in good faith. I will respond. If you're just gonna spam or just type stupid shit, I'm, I won't feel like responding. Definitely. But if you are a green name, I will feel like responding all the time. Hello, George. Welcome back. You're just tingling. Man, I hate people like that. It's coming in and derailing the stream. <laughs> like it, it, it creates like a negative environment for everybody, you know, like it, it completely makes it bad and I don't want that. That's not, that's not what my channel is about. That's not even if I am a negative person, if I can be an asshole 95% of the time. You know, I do try to be nice to nice people. If, that's it. Simple, bro. If you're gonna be a dickhead to me, I'll be a dickhead to you tenfold. If you're gonna be a nice person to me, I'll be nice to you. Simple as that. Just like in real life. Like, wouldn't you want... Like, when, when you walk out, when you step out into the world every day, when you wake up in the morning, when you have to, when you have to go for work or something, wouldn't you want... Wouldn't you... If you, if you res if you say hi to somebody in a nice way wouldn't you expect that back so if somebody's like fuck off if you say hi politely to somebody and that person s tells you fuck off then you you have every right to treat them like shit i feel like it's fair right that's that's how i am in real life same thing <laughs> how's it going george George fellow George and Rossi are you guys both of you guys are here both of you fellow fells are here <laughs> god damn it new meme brand new meme has been designed <sighs> what about that armor we, we got all the filakis. What about the armor? Thank you. Wait, let me see if Rossi is also here. I want to tell you guys something. You must be hungry for my travels. Look at all those food emojis. My God. Uh, I got my YouTube payout. I, I got it. So, thank you for all the support you offered this whole month, guys. Especially Rossi and... Uh, and George, I appreciate you guys. Thank you. I, I thought I would just thank you guys while you're here. It means a lot to me. Not that I'm expecting anything from anybody. I'm just saying, you know. I feel like it's worth mentioning to you, you know. Helps keep me going. Even if I did not, if I did not re meet the YouTube payout, like the minimum $100 payout, I would be okay with it, you know. No problem, Tony. No tingly. No. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thought I would say that because it's mostly both of you that are, that have been 
contributing a fuck ton this whole month of March. I don't expect anything for next month either. I'm just, you know, I thought I would just tell it to you while you're here. Please don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe so you don't miss out on any content. So I have another eight hours before I start. Forgot I have a sep. Better, uh, yeah, they. Um, you forgot I have a separate tip, tip link. I put it all the way down. That's why you don't see it, and I don't have it showing up in the chat. Because, like I said, I'm not doing it for money. I'm not doing YouTube for money. If, if I was doing it for money, like I would have PayPal links everywhere. Like I would have it show up uh, via Streamlabs in the chat every two, three minutes. I would be talking about it on stream. I would be having it on the channel about page. Uh, I'll be having it as a link. I'll be having it in, in the description. So I only have it mentioned in one place. That is like way bottom. So you're gonna have to scroll down. Every stream you open up, you're gonna have to scroll down all the way at the bottom. Only then you'll see the, the tip, uh, the donation link. Streamlabs donation link. It's up to you, George. I'm not saying anything, all right? I'm still happy that you're you're super chatting and, and donating and gifting memberships and you also you upgraded your membership to the mass edition player club which is huge quentin tonino tonino tingalino yes is it better for yeah like i get it instantly i don't have to wait for like a whole month i can just put it in like a separate account and you know i can pay off the hardware that i got every month or if i have extra money like i'll buy a game I'll buy a new game to stream, something like that. It's it's up to you. I mean it is better for me, but I'm not I'm not asking for it, definitely. I'm not asking for it. I'm i I'm still happy, bro. Like I'm still happy. Even one dollar, like even fifty cents, if you guys feel like donating or super chatting, it's still a lot for me, you know, so it's all good. attack on site here but thank you thank you Rossi and uh, George for all your major contributions this month thought I would tell it to you while you're here because I really appreciate it you know okay let me loot this thing Oh, there we go. I will I will take what you said, Rossi. I will keep in mind what you said. I appreciate the uh, the advice. Considering you're also a mod on the channel, I feel like you represent my my best interest. Yeah, that's what I thought. Like, yeah, but is it hard to set up those mods for a DS Remastered? I think it's mostly on Nexus Mods, right? NexusMods.com. Get the. Yeah, that's what. See, even you said the same website name, Nexus Mod. I already have an account on there. The oh yeah, I remember this place. I was uh, this asshole despawned last stream. This this captain, douchebag. Now oh, he's back here. Ah, oh, he saw me. Okay, I'll see what I can do. But the game, I don't mind playing the game. Vanilla, it, it doesn't look good, but but I can tell like people are gonna be upset. Like why why does the game look like shit? You know. George already warned me. The game won't look that good. Game look like a nightmare. <laughs> it's okay. I don't care how good or bad a game looks, but definitely if you're watching a stream. Like visual quality will matter, definitely. That that much I do know. 
So when I was playing Batman Arkham Asylum, nobody was complaining about the graphics. But people were complaining that it was an old game I was playing. I I still feel like Arkham Arkham Asylum still holds up today. I'll see what I can do. So you want me to start doing it on Sunday? Georgino? I'm going to start playing DS Remastered on Sunday. Make that a Streamlabs link. Uh, and I'm still doing nothing. Okay, okay. I mean, I'm like... I don't want like the primary focus of my channel to be all about money, guys. You know, I don't want to be one of those YouTubers that keep spamming their links in the donation links everywhere. But since you guys are asking, I mean, which you will nah. Let's not let's not paint that kind of an image. <laughs> George, PayPal link. Okay, well, we want like an exclamation mark link so you can. I can have it pop up in the chat every couple of minutes. I don't want to rush to play it for Souls game. Sometimes it's nice to take a little Souls. Soulscation in between. <laughs> yeah, you did say that, but um, I was thinking like I'll play Uncharted 2, rushing difficulty on Sunday. Like I, I will replace the uh, the the Demon Souls slot, time slot, with Uncharted 2. Play it for like the whole month of April, and then come back May, like around May time, and start Dark Souls remastered. First week of uh, May. I was thinking of that. Or, or like, let me know if you want me to play some other game, like on Sunday. Second uh, stream for Sunday. First stream, we, are, we still haven't finished uh, Ghost of Tsushima, but I can tell we are close to, to the end of the game. So once we are done with Tsushima, I think that's also another game we, we, we would have completed. So we, we are gonna have another slot free also. So I, I wanna fill it up. You know I want to play some Apex. It depends, bro. Like I, I cannot. People need to ask me if they, if if I am free, you know, or if they have time. I cannot keep going around asking because like a small misunderstanding happened. Yeah, she has to contact me, bro. Because I don't know like what her time frame is. She, she is up for it. She has expressed uh, the, her interest in playing the game with me and like I, I don't have the game installed as well. I just realized I, I opened up Steam yesterday. I don't even have the game installed. So I have to download the game which is like over 90 gigabytes. I don't know if I should play it on the PS5 or, or on PC. But I feel like on PC I would it would be better to communicate. PS5 it doesn't do well with the... Uh, with mics, you know. <coughs> Uh, sometimes what happens is like plans will change. If if I were to set up a stream or like set up a session between me and a subscriber, plans will change. Like things will change for them, and they will forget about me. So it's better that, that if they contact me, you know, on Discord. So until she does contact me, she makes she she is willing to to play with me for like like you know before a week starts or something then yeah i've already told her like like i told her let me know when you're free and you know i'll try to make something happen because this is what happened with me like edward i was supposed to play lethal company with him yesterday and last week already like when he was at my stream uh, i asked him like while he was in my chat what what can we play for next week you know and he said we'll play lethal company and i said yeah okay fine bro done deal you know and yesterday yesterday i got off of work in the morning and i messaged him and he's like no i cannot play with you right now because i'm i'm i made a promise to somebody else that i was gonna play with them i was like okay well, fine whatever and you know that that never ended up happening so like i said you know I told him next time if you want me to play if you want me to play with you any game just contact me on Discord or or, 
you know dms or like talk like you can ask about it while i'm streaming because if i go around and if if i'm the guy that's asking people if they want to play with me like it's it's not i can't tell if they are being serious or not now i'm not trying to paint a paint a bad light on edward maybe he forgot about it uh, you know he's busy most of the time i get it so it happens but if it's coming from like the subscriber side like they like it's a, like a genuine request that they want they want me to play with them then i know that they are being serious and that and that they are willing to allocate time for it so asha is also going to have to do the same because uh like i would ask rossi now sometimes like right now rossi is free on mondays but it could change in the future you know and if it does happen he will he will actually make an effort telling me like hey maybe uh, like i can't play with you on monday evening because my schedule has changed or he he will say something like that or maybe he's got like a an appointment or something you know something must have come up for him so it's all good i understand so when pl while playing with streamlabs it take over the screen yeah yeah so you know So it's tough it's tough um So I feel like people have to contact me if they want me to play with them no offense to Edward though like he's he's done a lot for my channel he spent hours like so many hours playing so many games with me but I get that even he has a life to live I get you know I I'm just trying to make it convenient for everybody that you know no issues arise Patrick also I think he messaged me remember like he messaged in the group he asked uh, uh hey are we going to play t uh, today I was uh, and I was so shocked because wait I've already made a plan with Rossi to play uh Truck Simulator why why is Patrick messaging me but it was my fault because I didn't announce in in the Discord server No, like I've already made a plan. It's I've already made a plan last week. Like he was here, you know, and even he he said like he wanted to play Little Company. I don't know why he changed it last minute. I was legit like half an hour away from starting the stream. Like I I was uh, I was going to start in half an hour and then I I message him and I ask him, "Are you ready? Can we do this?" He's like, "No, we can't." I'm like, "Wait, what?" But it's fine, bro, because even I have been late a couple of times. When he was ready a few times and even I've made I I've been late by 30 minutes maximum 30 minutes 45 minutes So I get it so when I can make mistakes I feel like even he can make them but when we made a plan like being late is one thing but completely like changing the plan altogether like now now that's different So no disrespect to him it happens you know That's why because of that like I've decided uh If people want to play with me, they are gonna have to bring it up. Like they are gonna have to ask me because I'm I'm mostly streaming. Like I'm I'm mostly making videos, you know. So you guys know me, but everybody's got lives to live. So people are busy. Yeah, like Mike just said, Asha works a lot. When she pops in, she's usually at work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she told me about certain things going on with her also. Also related work. So. Like I said I don't want to be the guy that keeps bombarding everybody pri on uh, like private DMs asking them hey are you free this day that day you know? like I don't want to be that guy if they if people feel like it bro let them contact me then I'll play with them So that's what that's that Is George here? I think I can't do that, Rossi. Uh, when playing with Streamlabs, make it chill. They take over the screen. Make one or two with read the room context. And also another thing I want to tell you guys whenever when I whenever I'm doing a community stream with 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 you guys like when I'm playing with you I will ignore any 
trolls in the chat. Like, I won't even bother responding. I don't want them to ruin ruin our fun time. Fuck no. I'll just ban them on the spot or I'll time them out. I've seen that happen a few times. I think, I don't think I can do that, Rossi. If it, I want it to be automated because if I keep spamming, if, if I keep, like imagine if I keep doing this every couple of seconds, like if I, if I keep typing stuff like this, every, like I've, I've got to look away from the stream and type it. I can't do that, you know? So I feel like having commands for rules is pointless. Besides, I don't have enough mods to, to be here. Those are like manual commands. I cannot keep typing them every few minutes. It's better like if, it's, if the Streamlabs rules are automated. I don't have to worry about it. Like stream, it's okay, you know. I don't. I don't think anyone has a problem with it. I don't have enough mods as of now. But I, I will still see messages. But I see what you mean. You you feel like the messages can be intimidating to new viewers. I, I, that's that's what you're trying to say, right? Yeah. Not much you can do about that, bro. No matter how much I increase the interval or how short I put the messages, they will still sk spam the chat. But that's what I want because, you know, I... There's no incognito way to do that. No, I'm like, I'm gonna have to get, like, take my hands off the, the keyboard, go to my laptop, type it. There's no other incognito way. It's tough. But I get what you're saying. But I, I will uh, make a command for the Streamlabs donation link. That I'll do. Level 41. No, that's what I've done, but it's still like... The triggers are not reliable, George. That's the problem. Sometimes... It needs like a couple of people typing in the chat. Sometimes it takes like one person to type to start the trigger. So it's quite inconsistent. That's the problem. No matter like... The problem with, with uh, setting up the, the timer, the time messages on Streamlabs is I'm gonna have to go live and test it out. I, I cannot go live. My stream has to be public so i can't if I, streamlabs does not function on a private stream or, or on an unlisted stream it only functions if you're on a public stream if i'm on a public stream then everybody's gonna tune in and they're gonna be like hey are you gonna be playing a game right now and they'll be like what are you doing and if i tell them i'm just testing out my commands you know that's gonna waste my notification limit per day i cannot i cannot do that so it's only now that you people are talking about it but so far i don't see anybody having an issue with it the reason why i have the rules pop up in the chat is because i i want people are gonna complain about me like for example some of brian's viewers they don't like me i think uh, rossi and george already know that so if they're gonna run off to brian and tell them that i'm being a, like tell him that i'm being an asshole to them for whatever reason i need to have everything documented you know I don't want my channel or like my, my me getting in trouble for no reason. I feel like I have a right to treat people any way I want. <laughs> if if they're gonna come in here, you know. So that's why like I have all those rules popping. Just covering my ass. Just covering my ass. I can tell like why it could be annoying. Don't get me wrong. Unfortunately, I don't have a lot of mods. You know. So there are some. Not, not not just Brian, also people from other streaming communities, other YouTube channels, they, they just come in here. They behave like assholes. I will roast them or I will talk shit to them or I will ban them. Or they will come and comment on my videos. And I will also have like a back and forth bar, a back and forth argument with them. And they'll run off and they'll go tell the, the whole community or they'll, they'll tell the streamer, Hey, you know what? This guy is treating me like shit. But they'll never bother telling them what they've done wrong to me, you know. So that's why like I've got all these rules popping. So that way, you know, whoever does manage to stop by, they'll know. Okay, maybe this person that is claiming that Anderson has treated them like garbage. Maybe they have done something wrong to, to provoke him. 
you know that's why that's why i have the rules here apart from that like i don't really have to have even i don't like like having the rules here bro but what to do it, it's it's that's the situation that i'm dealing with you know every day uh, that's not to draw attention here it is stressful for me but i also have redundancies everything is implied by the other messages oh yeah 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 that's also there I'm just trying to be descriptive as much as I can. I'm I'm because I don't want anyone trying to abuse any loopholes, you know. That's why that's why I've got like kind of the rules repeating each other, I guess, in different uh, strings of messages. That's why apart from that like I don't really I don't I don't like having streamlabs in the chat. And YouTube doesn't offer you a fucking way to like how on Twitch you have like the about page for a Twitch streamer it you'll have like a rules section and you can type as many rules as you want like 20 30 lines of rules on YouTube you cannot do that i i cannot have my description have rules you know and most people whenever they tune into a live stream they are not gonna they are not gonna click on the description they, people don't have time to to read a description if they're going to open up a stream but they people will look at the chat first thing people look at after they open a live stream is they'll see the chat That's why like I have everything sp being spammed spammed by Streamlabs. I could lower the amount of words. Oh, you don't like Ah, okay, I see what you mean. Okay, okay. I see what you're saying. You don't you don't like it having like paragraphs, big long lengthy paragraphs. <laughs> what the fuck just happened there? <laughs> What just happened there? I just swung my sword and it just blew up. It just exp that uh, trap, the the uh, brazier. They will attack on sight here. Hey. Oh, oh well, rare streamer moment. You know what? I think I'll do that. I think I'll do that. I I got wrecked there. Fucking idiots out there claiming that all 1000 of my subscribers are from Brian's channel. Whatever the fuck that means, bro. I mean so be it. I got you. Your time has come. Like you, you if you guys know me well, you know like I don't I don't share my streams anywhere. You guys know that the same exact morons that say that all 1000 of my subscribers come from this so called this this channel this big YouTube channel the same morons they they promote their own garbage streams on on his discord server and every other discord server that they know within the same community you know well, I thought I'll just say it because that's the like, That's what's going on, you know. People being assholes. <laughs> Did I get the? Uh... Ah! Oh, that's a good headshot. That's why I have the rules pop up. <laughs> But I get what you're saying, Rossi. I'll try to. I get free. <laughs> yeah. No, I mean let it be, bro. Like if that's how they want to form the narrative, so be it. The fuck do I care? <laughs> Honestly, bro. Like if I was taking away from from Brian's subscriber base, I would have like over thirty thousand or fifty thousand. Why the fuck would I settle for one thousand, right? It's so stupid, bro. Fucking buttered kids. Like real progress does does trigger does trigger kids, you know, grown as kids in grown as adult bodies. What's he doing? Come here, come here. Stop that guy. The thing is, like, I stream every day, you know, so.
one thing is like oh okay he's got 1000 the reason why he's getting views is because majority of people that watch him are from Brian's channel you know if, if it's not that then you know what they'll say they are the next thing what they'll say is he this guy has no life he doesn't have a job that's why he sits on his ass all day and he streams it's always one thing or, or another with, with these fucking jerk offs bro <laughs> But one thing is clear, no, people don't want me on YouTube. <clears throat> wow. Good luck with that. What power do they have exactly? They got no power. They can only like use their fingers. Just type on keyboards all day. Maybe get in a Discord voice chat, talk about me for like half an hour, one hour. Maybe talk about me on a live stream. That's all they can do. They are acting like I've, I've hurt their feelings or something. It's all, everybody's already moved on, but some some people can't move on, bro. They only have the power I give them, yeah, see? Exactly. <laughs> but that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, I'm just protecting myself, that's all. That's why, like, I have all the rules pop up. But I, I, I see what you're saying. I will try to keep the messages limited. I'll try not to have big paragraphs being spammed in the chat yeah, I didn't understand what you meant <laughs> less words same message okay okay I'll see what I can do that will take a lot of time though Oh, this asshole. No, wrong guy. Uh, can I throw it on this guy? Okay. I should swap weapons in the middle of the fight. He's bleeding. Is he gonna die from bleeding damage? I just shot him in, in his in his ear hole. Oh shit, he's still alive. That's why I like this bow. Bleeding damage. I'll see what I can do. Thanks for the feedback, Rossi. Did George also say the same thing in regards to the uh, Streamlabs thing? You you are right about that, Rossi. It it can get distracting when. Chat just goes crazy, you know. Like I'm looking at my my screen over here, and suddenly like I, I can sense like there's paragraphs being typed on on my second monitor but when i look at it it's, it's just fucking stream lab it's, it's nobody <laughs> know what i'm saying but i explained the answer well yeah, yeah. No racism period, you have questions, there's a <laughs> Oh, that's a nice way to frame it, yeah. Oh, you mean I've explained my reason as to why I have the rules spamming every couple of minutes? I mean, every couple of seconds? Oh, well, bro, that is just my curse, bro. Way less letters, same message. Alright, alright. I'll keep that in mind. Those are the cards I have been dealt with. I've got to I've got to do what what I should, right? You know. But 
But uh, yeah, you you are correct, George and Rossi. It's it's overwhelming. I see what you guys mean. Okay, guys. Um, I'm gonna end the stream right now. I I still don't know how much progress we've made. Gonna have my dinner. I'll come back tomorrow with uh, Arkham City hard difficulty. I'll I'll spend like another half an hour designing the thumbnail for it. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna end. See, look, there's still so much I haven't completed. Look at all this shit. This game, I haven't opened up this Desheret Desert. I haven't synchronized this viewpoint. Look at all this incomplete. I don't know how many more streams, bro. How many more streams? I thought I've made progress. Please don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe so you don't miss it out. It is so overwhelming. Content. Anyway, but I I do I do appreciate you guys being here. I do appreciate you. Yeah, it's a big game. Uh, you know, I thought Demon Souls was going to be a big game. But uh no, it's not. Uh ended up finishing uh Demon Souls. Thank you, thank you, Mike. I appreciate you being here. Ended up finishing Demon Souls within like the first three months. This one been going on for uh, since October. <laughs> Five, six months. Six months I've been playing this game. On and off, that is. Not, not continuously. Alright, if you're watching me for the first time, guys, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Turn on bell notifications for all so you don't miss out on anything. Comment down below if you have any feedback or suggestions and share my channel with your friends and families, guys. Uh, shout out to the people watching the stream, watching the replay, people in the chat. Shout out to Mike Mangold, Rossi, George. See, like I, I prefer if the gifted would go to Mike because see, he's at least using the emojis. Unlike some people I know. I feel like if the gifted went, went out to Asha, Mike, people that do find time to tune in whenever they can. Stop people like having zero interest and you know just wasting the memberships. But yeah, shout out to George, Rossi, Mike. Um, Travis was here, I remember his name. Uh, Dustin, thank you. Dustin was here. Rossi likes to call him Dennis for whatever reason. Jack Marston, thank you. Yeah, that's pretty much all I can see in the chat. My apologies if I missed any names. You got Asha last time. That's what that's what I want, you know. Like I wish it wasn't randomized. YouTube needs to fix that. So let's see. Sid was here. Yeah, Siddharth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to Siddharth. He must be sleeping. Siddharth's going through some tough times. He's been talking to me privately. Uh, let's wish him... Um, let's wish him good things to happen. He's going through some financial troubles. Uh, so he wants... He needs your prayers, guys. So if you, if you have... If you can manage it, just, you know, wish the best for him. Pray for him if you guys can, you know. It, it would help me, you know, because he's... He's uh, a person that discovered my channel. So... You know that much uh i i owe him you know so if you guys can help me out just just a simple prayer it would be great you did uh you did that one day yeah so let me see yeah so thank you mike thank you george george i know you're I think some of you are at work. Thank you for the prayers, Rossi. I appreciate that. See, already, already showering positivity. See, this is the, this is what I want. This is what I want my channel to be all about. The people to be. Thank you, thank you, Rossi. Thank you, guys. Uh, I will take the feedback. I will update uh, Streamlabs when I find time, but not tomorrow. Like tomorrow as in not the next eight hours from now. Maybe the day after. 
maybe two days from now so yeah um okay guys i'm gonna end the stream wishing you all a nice day and a nice night thank you all so much for your time patience and support guys honestly i really appreciate you you guys mean a lot to me um i hope you enjoyed the stream today hope you had fun here and uh, yeah i'll see you in the next one so take care guys bye see you soon thank you all so much